Hey everyone, I wanted to show you Google Maps today the, and how to use a street view. I think this is a really, really cool feature. I'm going to type in an address up here at the top. Uh, I'm going to use this one. And say I was looking in the Capital Village neighborhood of Rancho Cordova. Um, and I can get an aerial view here. I can even do a satellite view in Google Maps. But say I want to get a more detailed view of the neighborhood and really see what this neighborhood has to offer. I can do that actually uh, right here in this app. Uh, first thing I want to do is I want to hold down my finger at a certain location and then it brings up an address and all I need to do is click on that address and then some of the options are map directions I click on street view now not every neighborhood has this but a lot of neighborhoods do and what it'll bring up in just a sec is really a view of the street this one's kind of funny that there's a truck right here uh, and you can actually see the outline of a camera where Google um, or whoever uh, went by to take images of the neighborhood and so you really get an amazing, amazing view. And I imagine for real estate, you could show people, hey, this is exactly what the neighborhood looks like. Here's the view. It's not what someone just, you know, says uh, in the real estate listing because we all know that, you know, views can be very, very subjective. But the cool part is you can take this little yellow guy, hold it down, and you can scroll. And really, you can go through an entire neighborhood. The other day, I showed my kids the walk that I used to take um, when I was a kid or in high school um, from from the house we lived in to um, uh, to school and that was pretty cool and I also showed my wife's grandpa uh, the house he used to live in out of state um, when uh, when he was younger and so you can really go through a neighborhood like this and uh, the neat thing is that you can take this uh, this peg man this yellow guy and then uh, it, it's a circle whenever it's on the street but then it turns into a rectangle um, on uh, you know different different houses and such and when it's a rectangle then that means it will go and then it will show you uh, what's vertical and so pretty neat but let's back out here and this is also another use um, you can see um, here's a property in the Tree Lake neighborhood in Granite Bay now a lot of these properties are very nice and expensive but some of them back to uh, tower powers and so if you wanted to make sure that your property wasn't like that okay this one looks good so far but then oh hey right across the street okay your house if you were buying this house it wouldn't be impacted oh and look there again you can see the shadow of uh, the vehicle with the camera that went through but uh, lots of uses here and I'm just curious from you what do you think um, you could use something like this for for business uh, what do you think um, potentially um, you could have fun with maybe just in personal life um, I would be curious uh, to hear your thoughts and uh, just wanted to leave. Here's a shot of Times Square. Check that out. Pretty cool. Hey, thanks everyone. We'd love to hear what you think.